Hey everybody, welcome to BD Diesel, it's PT and Co. Here we are again in the R&D bay at BD Diesel and uh, we've got another exciting product uh, launched to tell you guys about. Um, this is our electronic exhaust brake for the Ram 2500, 3500 for your mm -hmm. 2013 to 2024 6.7. So this is a new addition to our family of electronic exhaust brakes. Uh, we've got a couple different part numbers for this product. One's going to be your 4 inch exhaust and the other one's going to be your 5 inch exhaust. Uh, install time on this particular product is about three hours. Yeah, about three hours, yeah. Much, much shorter than a traditional install if you've got an air compressor and airlines and all that kind right, of stuff. Right, exactly. A regulator and it, setting it all up and all that kind of stuff takes a little bit more time. Yeah. So um, the warranty on this, for all of you guys uh, conscious about warranty, it's uh, two years on the parts uh, and one year on the labor. Okay. Um, emissions, for those of you that are uh, CARB compliant, this is, uh, this is a number four, so one's not required. You can legally sell this product in all 50 states. And uh, let's get into a little bit of uh, why we created this product in the first point, Chris. Um, so first and foremost, we mentioned earlier that we've eliminated the airlines and the compressor right. and all that. The other big thing is that we wanted to eliminate some of the problematic com uh, components. Um, and so that led us down to the development of a electronic, electronic actuator exhaust. system yeah. versus an air actuator system. Yeah, so I'll, I'll elaborate a little bit on that. So with the, uh, the earlier versions um, and the, some of the exhaust brakes we still make are air actuated. And of course you have to add an air compressor to that. So that is a, another, you know, potential problem down the road, Another right? potential point of failure. Yeah, right? down the road maybe, uh, many years down the road. but. Uh, and then you have a regulator, you need to adjust it and set it all up. And there's, there's air lines, you know, and in winter time, you know, there's condensation getting in those lines and stuff like that. So, so with the electronic exhaust brake, you don't have that stuff. Mm. The other thing we were able to do by not having an air actuated brake is we were able to reduce the cost of it a bit, right? So you don't have the cost of that air compressor and the regulator and the lines and all that stuff. And we were able to bring this brake in at under $1,000. Awesome. Map price rather than like thirteen, fourteen hundred dollars with an air brake, right? So yeah. that was a big part of it. The other reason we developed it is for customers that want to have an exhaust brake still uh, that have removed their factory turbo, let's say, and gone to a non-VGT style, so they technically lose their exhaust brake feature, yeah. uh, but don't want to lose their exhaust brake. So now we have this; they can mount it down in line, like I mentioned. And under, this all plugs in with all the OEM yeah. dashboard and all those you other bet. controls? Yeah, so it just plugs right into where the turbo used to be. And then it uses the factory button on the dash. So you don't have to run a separate switch or find power and ground or anything like that. It's nice and simple. It even does the factory downshifting with the exhaust brake and all that stuff when you're in tow haul mode. Awesome. So it acts just like the factory brake, but it's a remote inline four or five inch electronic exhaust brake. Nice, so. nice. Let's dig into a few more of the features of this bad boy. As Chris mentioned, um, everything installs in line yep. um, with your current exhaust system. Yeah, it uses um, the OEM button. Right, right. right. Um, definitely cast iron construction. So this is a meaty, meaty, meaty part there that's not going to have any issues. Yeah, and these valves, like, I don't know if it's uh, something we want to talk about, but it's uh, made in Canada. So this casting <laughs> is actually cast in Canada. Yeah. and machined here at our facility. Excellent. So, so that's, uh, we do that all in house here. Uh, and assembled right behind me actually, yeah. is the exhaust brake department. Uh, that's where they assemble them. For, so I've been testing this, this is kind of my, I love this brake. I've been testing this for about three years or more. Uh, and I found that this brake actually gives me a little bit more braking power than the factory VGT does. Right. So we're creating a little bit more braking power and the factory VGT. And you've been does, running so. that test on, yeah, we live oh, up here in BC, geez. going up big hills. Yeah, so I tested it on my, I tested on my 2011 for quite a few years first, and now I've been testing this newest version for the 19 and up or 18 and up. Well, actually, it's a 13 and up part number because we made a few changes with the harness, but I've been testing it on the 19, and it works flawlessly. It works great. Awesome. You know, I've tested it in very cold temperatures. It doesn't, you know, not actuate. Uh, it, yeah, it works great. So Awesome. So those are some of the features. Uh, now let's get into the, the benefits. Um, like we mentioned earlier, the installation for this is much simpler. Uh, we've got a universal placement of the brake, uh, so that's nice and easy. Um, we mentioned durable Canadian-made cast iron construction, nothing yeah. from China. Um, again, you've got that reduction in noise. 
right? Yeah, you don't have those airlines going and all that. Yeah, other you don't have compressors stuff. running and stuff like that. Um, yeah. And like we've talked about before, it all plugs into your OEM dash. Yeah. Nice and seamless integration. Doesn't yep. feel like an extra add-on at all. You betcha. Um, so who, you mentioned you're one of the ideal customer for this. So yep. tell us who, who should have this in their truck. Well, the, we're selling them mostly to customers that um, have a 6.7 Cummins and have, like I say before, they've removed their factory BGT turbo, right? right. And they still want that exhaust brake. So the, the ideal customer is a guy, you know, towing heavy weight or just loves his exhaust brake and doesn't want to lose it. Um, this is a perfect, uh, perfect product for them. The other thing we didn't mention, well, you mentioned about how easy it is to install. That's also a customer savings, right? So the customer is saving money on the overall cost of the brake. Right. I mentioned it's under $1,000, plus the install time is only about three hours, where the air compressor ones are about five to six hours install time. Wow. So it saves the customer, you know, three, 400 bucks in labor as well. Wow. So. Very cool. Double whammy. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so this, is, this product is available uh, for sale today. Yeah. If you're a dealer. I'm running one on the 19 right now. And you're loving it. Loving it. Uh, if you're a dealer out there, uh, make sure you talk to any of our warehouse distributors out there. There's lots of them. Uh, get some of these in stock because there's lots of trucks out there that'll fit this unit. Yep. Um, if you're just a regular consumer, uh, check us out online at bddiesel.com or any of our partner online retailers. Uh, very easy to find the part. Like I mentioned, we've got a four inch and a five inch. Um, and if you're one of those guys that Chris mentioned, if you've got that factory turbo uh, eliminated and you're looking for uh, something that seamlessly gets into your OEM dash, uh, is a little less expensive, yep. uh, quieter, and works like a hot dam, uh, this is the product uh, that you guys want to get. So uh, check yeah. us out online and get one in your 6.7 Cummins today.